Welcome to the Al Jazari channel where we will explain the solution of some statics problems, these problems are from the 14th edition of the Engineering Mechanics book written by Hibbler and published by Pearson. The problem solved here is related to particle equilibrium, which is explained in Chapter 3. Problem F35. If the mass of cylinder C is 40 kg, determine the mass of cylinder A in order to hold the assembly in the position shown. The analysis of the given system shows that we have two external forces W A and W C. Consequently, tensions will be generated in chords E A, E B, and E D. Of course, the tension in chord E A equals the weight of cylinder A, while the tension in chord E B equals the weight of cylinder C. Accordingly, the free body diagram of point E will be like this. As stated in the problem, the assembly is held in this position. This means that the assembly is under equilibrium. Consequently, the summation of forces equals zero, or, sigma fx equals zero, and sigma fy equals zero, where the x and y directions are as shown. Resolving the inclined force TEB into two components. Horizontal component TEBX and vertical 1 TEBY where TEBX equals TEB cosine 30 degrees and TEBY equals TEB sine 30 degrees. Since it is required to determine the mass of the cylinder A or TEA, that is in the vertical direction, I will use the equation sigma FY equals zero. We have only two forces in the Y direction, TEBY in the positive Y direction and TEA in the negative Y direction. So, TEBY minus TEA equals zero. Replace TEBY by TEB sine 30 degrees. And then substitute by the value of TEB, which is 40 kilograms force. Consequently, TEA equals 40 sine 30 degrees equals 20 kilograms force. So, the mass of cylinder A in order to hold the assembly in the position shown is 20 kilograms. Thanks for watching. If you like this video press like and share it. And do not forget to subscribe to the channel and activate the alarm to be notified of the new videos. See you again.